Let's see who'll join him in next week's final. It's either Gary Lawson, who's the current indoor and outdoor national singles champion. He's 24, now living in Auckland, against Basil Rainsford, who has the New Zealand champion of champions singles title to his credit. Lawson made the final when Diane Hazelton conceded victory. After seven ends, Lawson was leading 9-1, while Basil Rainsford had won his first round match against Rod Fleming by eight points to five. Remember, this semi-final lasts for either half an hour or 11 ends. We join the match in the eighth end. Rainsford leads 6-2. He's using the brown bowls and is to play time will probably come into play in this i think doug they're, they're not going to get their 12 ends in indoor bowlers are used to playing in a hurry because all of their matches at a time but uh, at this level they want to be a little bit careful in what they're doing they don't want to rush their shots and there we see that pressure again we were talking about before chris with that first bowl to make it a good one and uh, that's what both players when they've got uh, the mat or first bowl are doing yes they can use the the weight that they use to deliver the jack gives them a guide as to the weight they need for their first bowl and that's that's the key to it now the jack's starting to get hidden from view <coughs> Gary won't want to leave it any later to get in there don't think he's got the weight disappointed I think as a novice uh, I would have said if you'd asked me earlier Chris uh, who I thought would have won this game and realizing of course that that uh, Basil Rainsford uh, is also a New Zealand player as is uh, uh, Gary Lawson uh, that I would have picked uh, Gary because of his uh, very convincing victory in the opening round uh, of 9-1 played yes. very well yes you certainly would have favored Gary to win this encounter but uh, Basil has proved steadier Gary's in real trouble here. If he can't score on this end, he can say goodbye to the game. And he's still a couple down. <coughs> this is the eighth end of 12. Remember, as we told you before, there's a time limit imposed mandatory 30 minutes and time is running out for Gary Lawson as I was just checking to see what options Gary had open to him and he's going to try and make it difficult for him I think he's done just that oh, he certainly is playing beautiful draw bowls Basil Rainsford causing all sorts of problems for Gary Lawson he's got the jack covered he's got the back bowl and he's holding four shots. What yes. more can you ask for? Yes, all, all Gary, well, Gary has two options. He can either drive at the head and try and cut the score down, or he can try and draw it. He's just, shaping up to draw. Just expanding on that again. If uh, he drove and put the jack off the mat, he's four down now. He would only go two down. But That's correct. It's a two-point penalty for knocking the jack off in indoor bowls and the singles. He's played this well. Oh, would the crowd like it? Oh, he got a brush and a shot. Oh, what a magnificent ball. He didn't get the shot. He deserved it. Well, he didn't get the shot. He did just brush the ball just in front of the jack. He looked as though he was going to pick it up cleanly. He didn't do it. Basil Rainsford got the shot. It's seven shots to two and eight ends are gone. Yes, the crowd certainly was with him on that occasion. Well, it certainly did like, look like the perfect shot, but it wasn't the beat. <coughs> I think that uh, time is going to be uh, Gary Lawson's enemy today, not the number of ends. Yes, he needs to score more than one now. He's got to get a two or a three. And Basil's not going to let him have that. Now Basil's ready to change his hand. He sees the danger of the black bowls 
that Gary's just put in. He's going to try and cover them. The shot is still there for Gary. He can move the jack. Yes, I'd imagine Basil would not be particularly happy with that shot. He's actually pushed the black ball through to make two catches now for Gary Lawson. So he's got to spring that jack. Well, he's got the shot. He's only got one. He would have preferred a better result, but uh, yes, he certainly didn't. Chris says needs to score. He didn't quite have the angle right as he approached the hit with that bowl. But, uh, Basil's trying to take it off him again. He really is playing masterful bowls. Yes, I think you'd have to name Basil as the winner on, on the bowls he's played. He's been much steadier than Gary. Gary's been trying to play catch-up bowls. Basil Rainsford of Auckland beat Rod Fleming in uh, his first round match by eight shots to six, and uh, Gary Lawson beat Diane Hazelton by nine shots to one. Final bowl from Gary Lawson. He's got to move that jack back. Oh. Well, he gets the shot. He gets a single. It will be seven shots to three now. Nine ends have been played. But uh, he'll have one eye on the scoreboard and one ear for the whistle. Yes, yes, they won't get their 12 in ends in, I shouldn't think, Doug. <coughs> he's four points behind, so he's got to still got to score a two, really, to stay in with a chance. Very high standard of play we're seeing. My word, I'll say. This is really the first opportunity that television viewers have seen extended coverage of uh, indoor bowls. I can't remember any, Chris. That's correct. There, there have been occasional items on the television on national championships, but they're usually fairly brief. Indoor bowls is not a high-profile sport at all. Well, let's hope it becomes one because of this. Eight selected invited players into this tournament opening round matches to make semi-finals to make finals and the finalists or well, the winner will take away a 14-inch color television set nothing he can do wrong Basil Rainsford There's the time now called. <laughs> this is the final end. Curtains, I'm afraid, for Gary Lawson. 7-3 down on the board. One down on the head. And this very is little chance of getting four, no matter what he does. Especially not after that. Oh, no. Basil Rainsford put on a magnificent display of draw bowls. Gary Lawson has three short bowls now with the jack moved off the center spot. So there comes the handshake and Basil Rainsford of Auckland.